How's it going, YouTube? So, I had a question on one of my videos um, that I wanted to answer for you guys. Uh, kind of a simple one, uh, easy to use. Apple has it off by default. Uh, that's enabling the dashboard. So, uh, if you guys were around in the Mac OS, I don't know, 10.67, uh, dashboard was enabled by default. It was one that you could just slide up and it was. Um, where you could have little widgets and stuff like that. It's still in the latest version all the way up to El Capitan um, here on Yosemite. And I'll just show you guys how to enable it. So you'll just go to your system preferences, which will be right down at the bottom here. If it's not, you can go into your finder and you can go to applications on the side here and you can go down to system preferences, which is right here. Uh, once you're in your system preferences, you'll want to go into the mission control panel. Now in the mission control panel here, dashboard is still an option. You can have it as a space or a layover. Uh, layover is kind of like it comes over on the desktop. I prefer it as a space. That is what you guys have seen me um, using. And now that I've enabled this option, I'll just quickly swipe up and we'll see now I have a dashboard. And I'll give you guys just a quick tour of the dashboard. I just restored this MacBook a little bit ago. But uh, so I can kind of you know re-enable this, and I wanted to catch up on the video with it anyways. You can move as you can see. I'm grabbing these around to add more. You can add more widgets down here. You can even get more widgets online. So there's a wide variety of widgets that you can grab right from the Apple Store here. So it's kind of old school, but uh, a lot of these widgets are work really good. I definitely set up as you can see on previous videos of mine a lot of customized widgets and I use notepads because it's really great when you're doing a project maybe with a fin or Final Cut or Photoshop or whatever you're working on you can make these quick notes you can slide back and forth and so on and it's just it's nice so that's how you enable dashboard I'm not sure why Apple doesn't enable it by default but uh, yeah Thanks for watching guys, rate, comment, subscribe, and we'll see you again next time. Cheers.